Located on the border of Argentina and Brazil, in the middle of the subtropical rainforest lies one of the most spectacular waterfalls in the world. Made up of 275 cascading waterfalls spanning up to 2,700 meters wide and 82 meters high, making it even larger than the world famous Niagara Falls, Iguazu is a UNESCO World Heritage Site that you need to visit at least once in your lifetime. There are two sites to Iguazu that you can visit, Argentina and Brazil. In today's video, I will be sharing with you our experience exploring the Argentina side of Iguazu Falls. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel if you find this video helpful. Thanks so much. When visiting Iguazu, we stayed in the town Puerto Iguazu, about 15 minutes away from the park. There are tons of hotels and restaurants. We stayed at La Casa del Rio, a beautiful place above the river. I'll drop the link in the description below if you wanna check it out. Iguazu Park is open daily from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. I recommend going early and on a weekday as it's more crowded later in the day and on weekends. The entrance fee for Argentine nationals is 1,500 pesos, about $4, and 5,500 pesos, about $15 for non-Argentines. You can also buy your tickets in advance online at a discounted rate. Make sure to check out the website before you go as prices may increase with rising inflation. Once you enter the park, you will have six different circuits or trails to walk along and see the different falls. When we went, the most famous circuit, Devil's Throat, was unfortunately closed due to a flood the previous year, so we explored the other circuits. Be sure not to miss the lower circuit or the superior circuit, as both of these had the most magnificent views of the falls, in my opinion. From the lower circuit, you can see the beautiful cascading falls at a distance and also see the Brazilian side. From the superior circuit, you will see the falls from up close, walking along the top of them and experiencing how grand they truly are. If you're feeling more adventurous and want to see the falls from the very bottom along the river, you can opt to do the Gran Adventura, a boat ride that takes you up the river and underneath the falls, literally. You will leave soaking wet. It's an adrenaline rush and unlike any other experience I've had before. The cost of this adventure is 15,000 pesos, about $40, and lasts about two hours. You can reserve it at any of the Gran Adventura booths within the park. I highly recommend trying it if you want a little more adventure. During your time in Iguazu Park, it is important to respect the many plants and animals living within. The park is home to over 2,000 plant species, 400 bird species, around 80 mammal species, and countless butterfly species. Some of the animals include jaguars, monkeys, pumas, toucans, anteaters, and otters, to name a few. The park is a conservation area with a handful of endangered species living within, so respecting their natural habitat is very important. Be sure not to feed the animals and to properly dispose of your trash. Inside the park, you will find a handful of restaurants and kiosks. They are a bit more expensive, so I would recommend packing food and snacks if you wanna save a bit of cash. That wraps up this video. Thanks so much for watching and and I hope you found this info helpful. Please be sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on other videos similar to this one, and we'll catch you later.